The world is a dangerous place to live, not because of the people who are evil, but because of the people who don't do anything about it, said Albert Einstein. You are sending your kids to school every day, most likely not wondering if they are okay. Will they come back home? You are definitely not thinking that your kids are about to lose their lives to a gun. There have been 239 school shootings in America since Sandy Hook. Do you think that's okay? There have been 438 victims, 138 of which have died. Sooner or later, that could be your kids out there losing their lives to a gun. That could be your sister, your brother, your cousin, nephew, maybe even your aunt or uncle. This violence won't stop unless we speak up. Still not convinced this is a problem? Then sit back and listen up. Parkland shooting. This year, 17 dead. 2015, Uumpa Community College. 10 dead. 2012, Sandy Hook Elementary, Newton, Connecticut. 28 dead. One of the most tragic school shootings. It doesn't, speaking and speaking up, did you hear about that huge march that happened in Washington? An 11-year-old girl, only in elementary school, was speaking to hundreds of thousands of people, talking about gun violence, taking a stand, saying, no, never again. Just like that passionate fifth grader, I'm here to say never again to gun violence. It doesn't matter if these happened in the past. Where was the government when we needed them? Where is the government now after the 18th school shooting in 2018? Where are they now after all those marches and walkouts? Kids' lives being taken by guns. What if it was one of the people who worked for the government whose child got shot during a school shooting? Would action be taken? Would the victims finally be seen as people and not numbers? Would new laws be created? Would the violence finally end? I, a fifth grader, had to practice running out of my classroom with my hands up like one of the Parkland survivors. Kindergartners across from me did the same. Is this our new normal now? It can't be. Martin Luther King Jr. once said, our lives begin to end the day we become silent about things that matter. This is exactly what the government is doing. We're losing lives because the government is silent and won't write a better gun control law. Is this fair? I'm not saying everyone turn in all your guns. I'm just saying that not everyone needs access to these automatic rifles. Why does John Doe Citizen need a gun that can shoot 10 to 45 rounds per minute? Meanwhile, we're having kids, teens, and adults losing their own life because the government is most likely sitting there on their couch watching about the different shootings that happen on the news, offering their thoughts and prayers, but not doing anything. Success in life is not about pulling a trigger, but rather taking a positive stand to move forward.